My name is Chloe and I'm a senior here at CCU in the nursing program. Um, my favorite part about the labs is our simulations. So we actually have all of these rooms um, like this with the mannequins. And we have high fidelity and low fidelity mannequins. Um, this is one of our high fidelity mannequins. Um, and our professors can actually make simulations and scenarios just like real patients. Um, and they just kind of test our knowledge to see what we would do in that whatever sense is happening with our patient. So um, whether it's give medication really quick, um, whether it's put on oxygen, it's just the critical thinking that you do in the hospital setting but here in the lab. And my favorite part is that they always encourage us this is a safe place to mess up. Um, and so, yeah, they just encourage us to do our, our mistakes and our messing up here so we don't do them in the clinical setting. So, great. Okay. So the CCU Simulation Lab is probably about eight minute drive from CCU. So we definitely encourage um, your last two years, so your junior and senior year, to have a car as a nursing student because you'll be driving to Simulation Lab and then you'll have your 12 hour shifts that you need to get to as well. Um, and so it's not too far of a drive, it's super close. So our mannequins are super um, high quality, high level, high fidelity. Um, and we're able to put IVs, um, fully catheters, put medications, IV medications, take their blood pressures. Um, we actually have a pregnant mom that can actually give birth and you can feel real contractions. Um, so yeah, you can actually hear their lungs, their heart, their bowel sounds, um, and they can actually blink and talk. So they feel like real patients and so you start to get really comfortable just coming into a patient's room, introducing yourself um, and just saying, hey, I'm your nurse today, this is what I'm gonna do. And it makes it so much more um, comfortable when you walk into the hospital setting. Right. CC has really good relationships with a lot of the hospitals across the whole front range. Um, we've had experiences and rotations at most of the hospitals in the Denver metro area, so um, a lot of hospitals love having CC students. We've built a really good network, so um, I feel really confident and competent leaving CCU, hopefully finding a job as a registered nurse, and we've made those connections. We've had those clinical hours in multiple hospitals, so um, we've built really good relationships. Mm -hmm. So during our simulations, we have our professors on the other side of a double-sided mirror, and they just basically do everything that the mannequin, or in this case, the patient will do in a real setting. Um, so they can actually talk through the mannequin, so their voices will be through a microphone, and they can kind of talk to us as the patient, and we'll respond, and they can hear us, and so we can have these conversations. Um, the At the beginning of every lab, we start in the classroom where we have a devotional. Um, so we start every morning with a devotional, which helps just calm everyone's nerves, um, just helps us recenter in Christ because it's the whole purpose and reason why we're here to be an awesome Christian nurses. So we start with a devotional, which I love, um, and then we just kind of start in the classroom and talk about anything that we're going over the day and just kind of talk about our schedule, um, talk about any of the material we had to do before lab in preparation if we had any questions. Um, and then they'll split us up into groups into the different skills lab rooms. Um, and then we'll practice on our low fidelity mannequins, um, any skills that we're learning that day. Um, and then at the end of every day, we'll have our simulation where we come to the high fidelity um, and then they will be on the other side of the mirrors. Um, and that's when we're, they kind of test the knowledge for the day and what we've learned. One of my favorite things about CCU is just the small feel of our nursing program. It's so high quality, but we have smaller cohorts, which gets you, um, you just have the opportunity to be really close friends with all of your nursing students, and you'll be friends with them for a long time because no other person realizes like what nursing school's like except for your nursing school friends. So that's what I really appreciate. Like my cohort is only 16 of us, so we've gotten really close um, just studying, but then also doing life together outside of school um, when we have the opportunity. So that's my favorite, just of the um, just small Christian feel that CCU has, especially in the nursing program. It definitely helps you just advocate for one another and be good fellow Christian nurses. Um, and then that will just, those characteristics and those, um, just everything that you learn from here, you can bring out into the um, clinical setting and you can be that for other nurses in the field. So it's probably one of my favorite parts. So the cool thing about our labs is we actually have all the supplies that you would in a real hospital. So we have all the, I mean the medications are normal saline, but we have all the medication bags, the IV bags, the, uh, the vials that we drop medications from. We have all the needles, um, we have all the tubing. So when you actually go to put, um, give real meds in the clinical setting, it feels so normal and practice because we've done that on um, our mannequins here. 
So everything that I'm learning is very applicable, um, and it's very, it's just, you can apply it to what, literally whenever you're going into the political setting, and as soon as I graduate and become a registered nurse, um, I just had such great examples of what Christian nurses look like, so I feel very competent to be a good Christian nurse. Um, and they definitely challenge you, not only academically, but through your faith and making sure you're staying on top of your faith and being intentional with the Lord. And healthcare is just a scary field to be in overall. It's, you see a lot of sad things. Um, you're with patients in their worst times of their whole life. Um, and so what better place to bring Jesus into those patients' rooms and into your patient care. And so what I've learned in the clinical setting too is you can tell um, just when a nurse walks in a room with the love of Jesus and the care of Jesus and it makes a difference when it comes to caring for patients. That was nice. supreme! Okay. <laughs>